Welcome to Modern Living. I'm Kathy Ireland. China is growing as a hot market for American travelers, especially those who are looking for new and exciting under the radar destinations. Offering a wealth of cultural, historic, and agricultural wonders, Suzhou, China has an ideal combination of compelling tourism attractions. Travel expert Julia Diamond is here to share more. Welcome to Modern Living. Thank you, thank you for having me. Julia, could you please tell us about some of the current trends that are driving the travel industry? Well, one trend I'm seeing uh, quite a bit of is this thirst for experiential travel. So people want to really tap into local experiences, have authentic experiences, and also go to off the beaten path destinations. You don't want to come home with the same stories that everyone else has. You know, you want to go a bit off the tourist trail. And one great destination to do that is Suzhou, China. And what is Suzhou Tourism doing to meet the demands of today's travelers? Mm -hmm. Well, Suzhou Tourism, I mean, the aim is to promote and to educate uh, people about the destination. So they've got all these interesting marketing campaigns, and the goal is just to, to spread the word about Suzhou and really put it on the map for travelers. The Tourism Board has this really fun social media campaign, and it's called A Curated Look at Suzhou's Art and Culture. No visa required. You'll see, you know, across their social media channels, so Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, um, they've got online contests, and they're partnering with influencers, and they've got all kinds of interactive videos. So it's a pretty comprehensive um, marketing, you know, campaign. People can go to uh, traveltosuzhou.com and they can find out more about the destination there and book a tour and check it out for themselves. Julia, can you please tell us a little bit about Suzhou and what you like most about your travels there? It's known as the Venice of the East because of all the canals and waterways. It's a city with a rich history, tons of culture. It also has these modern contemporary hotels. So it's this great mix between sort of the old China and the new China. Beautiful gardens, pagodas, museums, temples. There's a, a ton to do. And which major attractions in Suzhou should be on a person's to visit list? The number one garden on your hit list should probably be the Humble Administrator's Garden. Now this garden is the biggest, it's the most popular, and it dates back to the 1500s, so it's uh, very historic. I would go to the countryside to experience the water towns. And this is a, a great way to experience the Venice of the East, getting on that gondola, cruising through the river, and just seeing that, that river life that will kind of bring you back in time. What is something that you can recommend for families looking to have an adventure in Suzhou? I would definitely start at the Ferris Wheel Park. There's a giant Ferris wheel. It's over 400 feet tall. So for the kids, you know, it's kind of an adrenaline rush. And for the adults, you can get sweeping views of the city. If you're looking for something a little bit more traditional, a little bit more cultural, I would head to one of the gardens to see an opera. Well, Julia, the opportunity to visit Sujo, it sounds too good to pass up. It sounds amazing. And it's clear that your efforts are going to make this dream come true for your customers. So thank you so much for joining us thank today. You. Thanks for having me. Thank you. For Modern Living, I'm Kathy Ireland. Thank you for watching.